Hey, what's up everyone and welcome to another reaction video for today and I'm here to take a look at a brand new UNSC archives video for Halo Infinite. This one's called Lightbringers, which uh, has two uh, dirty looking people on, or I guess there's three, there's another one. I just, I don't know why I just noticed this guy on the, on the left here. I don't know, <laughs> I've been looking at these two the entire time. I'm like, wait, hold on, there's another, there's another person. So three dirty people, it's not, it's not, it's not, it's not called uh, shower bringers. <laughs> It's a little, a little joke. Take a shower whenever you want. Anyway, UNSC archives. Um, these have been really good so far. I like the last one, which was all about the making of the uh, the grapple shot. Uh, the first one was all about a soldier uh, and telling his friend's parents about his uh, friend, their son. I thought it was really well done. The last two, great. Uh, this one, I think it's going to be even better, even if it's not. I'm sure it's gonna be great. So anyway, let's go. You ready? Three, two, one, play. Yes. Oh, active exoskeleton. What, we, what is it about? Have the covenant bombarded a UNSC excavation. Site colonial miners volunteered to extract an ore needed to fortify the Massachusetts exoskeleton. Only the ore reached the surface before the ongoing attack threatened total uh, something. Ooh. That's terrifying. So that's why they're dirty. Screwed. It sits back down. Thanks, Charles. Really motivational. Buried in the oh. heart of an ancient moon, he always dreamed of the fight. Glory was won while his brothers were lost. Getting the 1917 vibes here. Life blown away in the blood that he gave, an offering unrecognized. Never became what he already was. Is that the darkness that brings on the light. Never became what he already was. Halo musical. to the stars. That was pretty good. Some good singing in there too. Wow. Dude, these, these get pretty emotional. You know, I thought Halo was all about grabbing a grunt and th making him hurt. But, <laughs> grabbing a grunt and making him hurt. But, uh, you know, I guess I was wrong. I've been playing all these games all weird. I mean, no get me wrong, Halo has its fair share of emotional moments, though. Um, I feel like at least one game has its big emotional moment, you know? I feel like every game, yeah. Let me think, Halo 1, yeah, I guess, maybe, I don't want to spoil all these games, maybe Keys, I guess, 2 would be, Halo 2, what would Halo 2 have that's really emotional? 
I'm sure I'm like immediately. I mean, Halo Three has a couple. Halo Two. What? Which moment would be like a mo? I guess maybe when Cortana gets kidnapped. I guess. Or like, yeah. Um, maybe. Uh, and then Halo Three would probably be like Johnson. Uh, Miranda Keys, maybe. Uh, then four, obviously. If you played that, you know which part that is. Uh, Halo 5 would be the whole fucking game because it sucked. Uh, no. uh, and then Halo Wars, I hear, has a couple of moments like that. Uh, Halo Wars 2, I'm not sure. A ODST. I feel like there's some good emotional value in there. Like, just roam around the city, kind of. I want to play ODST again. I might actually start that up again. Uh, anyway, whatever. So... Halo Infinite, UNS UNSE Archives, uh, Lightbringers, really good, very well done, some good singing, uh, pretty emotional, uh, and uh, very well done. So, there you go, that is that, I'm looking forward to more, I mean, the game doesn't come out for another little under a month, even though there's a slight rumor about something happening on the 15th with Halo, because that is the 20th anniversary of Halo, and that's when the Xbox event happens, so... Maybe, maybe some free-to-play multiplayer coming out then, and then the full game comes out later. You never know. That'd be amazing. Battlefield would be fucked. No, it'd be fine. Uh, but anyway, there you go. That's it. Bye.